Hello and welcome back to my channel. I'm live. I'm sharing a low carb Aldi grocery haul today. I went to Aldi and did my in between kind of shop. I did a huge shop the other day and today is my kind of just topping up. So I thought I'd share everything that I got. Let's start with our veggies as always. I've got some spinach and mushrooms which are my low carb staples from Aldi. And oh, I will be, I'm just in the finishing stages of putting together an Aldi shopping list, my go-to Aldi shopping list. And as soon as that is ready, I will stick it in the description down below. So check out and look out for that. So we've got mushrooms and spinach over here and zucchini. I've just been feeling like making zucchini noodles. So I got some zucchini to make zucchini noodles and lemons. I have just been feeling like making some lemon sweet treats. So we've got heaps of cream and lemon and I've got some other ingredients already in my fridge, in my pantry. I want to make some lemon, some lemon desserts. You'll have to watch out for that. And dairy moving along over here. I've got my feta. This Aldi feta is really awesome. I've found it recently and it tastes like really expensive fancy feta when it's actually an Aldi brand. An Aldi feta is really good. And my butter. I've, I like having unsalted and salted butter, both of them, because I find that for cooking savory, cooking eggs or vegetables or meat, anything that I'm cooking that's savory, I like to use salted butter. And then when I have my hot chocolate, I like to use unsalted butter. So I have salted and unsalted. Unfortunately, there was only an organic salted, not an unsalted, but I don't mind. I kind of get what I can. And at Aldi, I like to say they've got a limited but useful organic range. So I get what I can and moving down we've got some smoked salmon over there um, smoked salmon from Aldi it's really good um, and it's awesome I love having smoked salmon and scrambled eggs the cats come to say hello um, and we've got some cucumber in the middle another one of my staples always chop up some cucumber for salads and Brussels sprouts first time I've got Brussels sprouts in ages so I look forward to sauteing them and having a play and just seeing what recipes I can come up with to share with you in due course and moving along we're going through this really quickly today as i said it's a smallish haul um i've got some corned beef silver side <laughs> the cat is sniffing i've got some corned beef silver side i was really excited look at that thick layer of fat on it that's going to be absolutely beautiful i'm going to be making that for dinner tonight and then we've got some meat for lunches for the next couple of days and finally we've got some beef mince three star Whoop, beef mince you can see that it's got <laughs> nice fat on that as well the lower the star the higher the fat content so i'm quite happy and it's also much cheaper so that is my low carb aldi haul for today thanks so much for tuning in to those who are watching live i really appreciate it um and those watching in the replay thank you um <laughs> the cat is distracting me today live no editing cat is just in my face today um so that is the haul. I will leave a link down below to show you um, to, with a link to all to a shopping list with uh, my favorite shopping at Aldi. Um, I'm not sure exactly how much this cost because I also got heaps of stuff for my kids and they don't keep keto and I got a whole lot of things as well. Um, for the house so I didn't actually break down how much everything here was but as you can see the meat was and that was the most expensive item $11.25 I think the beef mince was a few dollars two three dollars something like that um so yeah I don't actually know how much this little haul was but it was kind of an in-between I do a massive shop at Coles and then kind of just fill in the blanks going to Aldi so there you go thank you so much for watching and we'll see you again soon Bye.